we don't need history aku kuchaguana every 5 years ndo imefanya inji ienda hivi because huyu ataingia for 5 years ajinyang'anya aibe tu sababu aingia siingia already amepata umeelewa so if a president tuseme for example president ameingia gdp kiwa like level 6 tuweza muambi ukifikisha 11 genuinely we don't need an election ka hapo ndio sasa unapata no devolution magovernors wanapata pesa from there management systems kila kitu imefanyika poa na president ana pressure kushida kuiba jua naingia kuiba tu and that's why i say political kingpins are criminals crooks murderers tribal goons who has been crowd to benefit on behalf of their communities for example yeye mune ameingia kwa billionaire atatoka hapa kwa trillionaire mwenye alimchuse atatoka hapa kwa shillingionaire kenyata aliingia kwa ndurulionaire By the time anatoka alikuwa trillionaire wakikuyu walikuwa simuonea. Moi the same. Guys, so it's just, just like that. Yeah. So kuna wenye nchi na wananchi. Si zote ni wenye nchi ni ujinga tu tunakonga nayo na uoga mingi. Uoga mingi ya kusema hapa mambo yendi poa na kupewa shilingi bili unakubali. Si zote ni wenye nchi. Hakuna anga kuna mwenye mwenye nchi na wananchi. Si zote ni wenye nchi my friend. Tunachangia sababu hii nchi hizi fika hapo bila ushuru yetu. No no. So this is what when and that's why I normally tell you. Usikie mtu akisema government of so and so ametoa serikali wapi? So for example sisi tunaweza sema William Ruto ametoa serikali ya Kenya wapi? It's our government. He's a Kenyan like us. Ni venye ndio the symbol of unity tumemweka pale democratically. Lakini sasa unaanza kusikia sasa ni yake. Why? Tunafaa kumkumbusha bro si yako mzee. Si yako ni yetu si zote. Tubakishie. Tugawaneni. Yeah yeah. Ambia kimbikimbi kitu. Ah kimbikimbi is my guy. Mm, kimbikimbi tulianza naye anaitwa Oyuko. The first time nilienda ni Jakaranda nili notice kimbikimbi is more of a comedian. Na kimbikimbi hakuwa anapewa nini aonge. No. Na nikampusha kaambia na kimbikimbi tuta form kitu inaitwa Senate. Tunacho mimi kila mahali kila mahali mimi nakuanga mtu idea. So tuka form kitu inaitwa Senate whereby ya kwanza ni parliament hiyo bunge ya mwananchi na jioni kulikuwa na senate wewe tunaita wanahabari tunapeana eh, una unatafuta wanahabari unaongea unasema i have something private i want to talk so hiyo ilikuwa naona inaongea leo usiku kwa kuangiza ilikuwa inaitwa senate so i'm the one venye ni reform nikamwambia na ukifanya senate vizuri na utrend ama watu wakubali what you say utakuja hapa parliament you see yeah na that's because your time kina wakanga na ngaucho hao ndo walikuwa wako juu na moshi ndio alikuwa anaanza kuingia ingia but kina kimbiki there is another guy called Kindiki wengine liwaambia how they can do the various g consistency yao ndio ikuwa mingi so na mimi nilikuwa napata advantage nilikuwa na jamaa anaitwa Mesheke sababu sisi ni watu from Mount Kenya you see so napata like our platform is there but i could feel because i know even if see your platform ya hapo i'll still get another one so i told kimbi kimbi bonga hiyo ukisikia kitu watu wanataka kubonga we bonga liwe liwalo tuko you don't know you are where you are kimbi kimbi is doing well uh, i wish him all the best but nataka kumwambia bro si kuongea tu vitu u trend make money kama uji ku make money akuje ni muongeleshe ni muelezee how he can now capitalize on what he is doing sababu akai hapo sana mwingine anakuja yes alafu baba huwa anawalipa uh, me personally i've never met raila odinga i've never met babu wino but uh, i meet with their friends and i do not know if baba pays anyone or he does not pay but all i know uh, in one there's a time we sat down and said we are not doing this for money we we are defending raila because of the contribution he has done for the nation so far he is the best he has done yani hii nchi i will not understand jezi eleo ingekuwa aje bila raila and what he has done for the nation and that's why sisi wengine wetu tumeona wazazi wetu sababu yake zile mambo alipendekezwa alipendekeza kwa parliament na nini kwa serikali haki za binadamu na vitu vingine so the only thing we can do ni kumwambia asante through showing him love appreciation na kumwombea maisha mazuri na kumwambia ngangana tu na pia tume copy from him there are many things alafu ya mwisho people think that baba pays us and uh, i would say i would never i would never want to feature in the salary 
ya kulipwa na baba chenye naweza taka ni baba kunimenta sababu the people baba has mended today they own this nation ruto was mended by baba mudavadi alikuwa mtu wa mkono ya baba waitango alikuwa mkono okay ruto is the president alikuwa mtu wa mkono wa baba mudavadi prime minister the first time alikuwa prime minister amekuwa akiwa mtu wa mkono wa baba uh, waitango amekuwa mtu wa mkono wa baba today is the speaker of the national assembly amazon kingi is the speaker of the senate odm alikuwa mtu wa baba kina <laughs> Ata kina kuria na wengine wote wamepitia kwa mikono ya Raila Amolo Odinga. So we feel is a safe hand. So he is our charm in one way or the other. Yes. No, you are a very intelligent guy. So niko na swali. Sisi wali serious kuchangamsha tu. So there are 30 wolves in a farm. There are 30? 30 wolves in a farm. 28 chicken. How many didn't? There are 30 wolves yeah, that was mm. 28 chicken mm. how many didn't didn't what you're here for a slightly okay okay ndakujibu next time thank you <laughs>